Shall I try to equip you for this mission as well as my capabilities allow? But what I can't actually gauge is how you're going to soak up the punishment of just existing there. The isolation, the loneliness. You've got to be conscious of that, Harry. See, there'll come a time when you want to tell someone about yourself, however obliquely, however much at a tantrum. Dead if I get close to him. Because a man kills a politico in London, you come here. That's what I came for, yes. Howard Rennie was the man who interrogated the girl who hanged herself. You know why she hanged herself. The brigade wants this one, Billy. Wants it fast. It's special to them. Keeps him shot. Soldier shoot you. And you face in the gutter and turn you over with their boots. It's a weekend. It's a weekend in Belfast too, not just in Whitehall, not just in London. I repeat, I have to speak to the controller of the agent. It's a matter of some critical importance. Yes, I'll tell you how important. It's in the papers that half Provoland's looking for him. Don't you tell me to calm down. What's the name? Davidson. And the number? Thank you. Get me that number, please. If it's engaged, then keep trying it. Yes, sir. They're going now. That a man who shot Henry Danby was in the Ardoin Social Club a week ago last night. He was taken in by the army. His wife was with him. She was wearing a yellow trouser suit. And he was the only one taken in by the army who was not a kid. Now, the photo fit was very nearly right. Bloody kicking myself. You got all of this? Marvellous. Incredible, Harry. It's all on tape. Well, we've got a bit of a problem. It's a girl who identified me, Josephine Laverty, from Clonard. It's all I've got for Trace. Now, she's the source. She knows what I'm here for, so get her out. Right, no problem. Listen, Harry, I've got to know where you are. Yeah, it, it's very unprofessional not being able to reach you. The whole thing's been unprofessional. I'll hear it on the radio. When you've nailed him, I'll get up then. Hello, Harry? Harry, can you hear me? They're going now. Now the man who shot Henry Danby was a I'll leave it back. I don't know. Late. It's night. Ah, oh, late tonight. Don't sit up. Billy Downs, 41, you please, Avenue. 
out. Have you got the time? Have the time. I'd be better off doing bloody foot patrol than this. Is down special? Nah, not special. Yeah, here's a bit more for you, Boo. The bear? From 23? Who's doing there, Dustin? Oh, that'll please intelligence. God knows what's the point of us logging the lengths of this. The point is, we're out of the Sarge's sight. Out of bleeding drain. And out of arm's way. Oh, she's a fair looking bird, that. Come here. Oh, oh fire. Hello, Billy. Look, don't think I get any pleasure out of this, Colonel Frost. It's as unsatisfactory for me as it is for you. No, I'm not going to apologise. I've given you good information. Damn good material. You won't find me grudging the quality of that information, and you won't find me sniping at the calibre of the man who provided you with it. I doubt he deserves either of us. Now, what's the priority? You've got three priorities today, Colonel. Identify a man who was at that dance accompanied by a woman in a yellow trouser suit, and pick him up, right? Put in protective custody a girl called Josephine Laverty from Clonard. Right? Locate Harry McAvoy. Well, turn over every scrapyard tomorrow morning. Well, I know it's Sunday. Look, just do what you can, will you, Colonel Frost? I'll have a photograph of Harry with you by this afternoon. Yes, I'm sorry. I know, I know you'll do what you can. It's just a bastard, isn't it? McAvoy, you're too late for breakfast. It's near lunch. It doesn't matter about lunch. Is something wrong? No. no. I don't think so. Or is Josephine coming right? With only one guest in the house. Not until after the weekend. He was out this morning, a couple of hours. He's back there now. I'll check this, Josephine Lafferty. That's Clonard, her uncle's place, Joe O'Reilly. He's in hospital corpse and she's back there with her mother. She'll know who Harry bloody McAvoy is, whether he's clean, whether he's mucky. <laughs> she's been in his bed, she'll know. On a Sunday. Hello, sir. Routine or something special? Special. You turned over Ardo in the social club last Saturday night. You pulled in a male adult who was there with a woman in a yellow trouser suit. I'd like the name and address of that man. There was only one man, the rest were kids. Now, this is a priority. Well, that's simple enough. Freddy, that was Alpha Company, two platoon. Call up the platoon officer, get that night's log up here. Sir? You don't have any of Clonard? Uh, Clonard's with the neighbors. Fusiliers have it. Oh, I'd be grateful. Could you ask them for a trace on a Josephine Levity who lives at Clonard? Will do. It'll all take a bit of time. You'll have a drink while you're waiting. You're going to wait. Thank you. Confidential this. You, you, you didn't have a report of a man who's different to her, out of the ordinary at the club that night? Out of the ordinary? In what way? Could have been one of ours. No. None of them were different. I'll pour my own. Thank you very much. Please handle the lavity matter now. Sir. Oh. Howard Rennie, Chief Inspector, 
special branch. It'll hurt them, Billy boy. Not like London, but it'll hurt them here. Hurt them so they scream. Howard Rennie, interrogator. He's a hard bastard, Billy. But then, so is you. Billy won't miss you. Take him, Billy boy. Take him good and hard. Just keeping you posted, Colonel. Still waiting for Alpha Company's log. Fusiliers in Clonard don't have a Josephine Laverty listed. Of course, if Laverty isn't the householder's name, then... Uh, can I top you? Friends of Josephine. Is she in? Washing her hair upstairs. What color? Get yourself into the kitchen, Mom. Make yourself a nice long cup of tea. There'll be a surprise for the girl. Seeing us all. for you. This fella, a McAvoy, that you've been going over with. Who is it? Who is it? Now, where does he come from? What is from you? I've not much time. Who is it? You have none of the loyalty to him that you should be given to us. Thank you, Mrs. The kettle's boiling.
Don't know how long I'll be you stay here. Billy Downs, 41 Ypres Avenue. Thank you. We've an observation post on Ypres Avenue. They list all movements. I have a platoon on immediate. Is he important? It's not one of our familiar names. You could say we'd like to have Mr. Downs. Negative on Downs. He's been out more than two hours. No one else is left oriented. Over. This signal, Alpha category. Immediate report needed. Repeat immediate report needed if down sighted entering Ypres Avenue. Over. Understood, sir. Immediate report in when Downs returns. Over and out. Yeah, they want Downs, so keep your eyes open. Now you're not going out with your bikes, not at this time of night. Oh. Well, did you put the light on the garage for Daddy? I'll do it when I finish this. Excuse me, Mrs. Rennie, is it? Yes, that's right. Put your hands behind your head. Don't shout. I know the kids are in the house. All right, we'll go in there now. Just remember this. Try and clever and I'll kill you. You and the children. Now, I'll warn you once more so there's no misunderstandings. And he moves, and you're dead. All of you. I'll be watching you all the time. So be very careful, missus. Now we're gonna wait. Got it! We've got a name. Then it's all down to Harry. Terrific. Billy Downs. And he's coming out. As soon as it's on the radio, up and away for Heathrow. When's the pickup? Oh, he's out, this Downs, out of his house. Drinking his last pipe for 20 years, no doubt. They'll lift him as soon as he's home. I knew Harry would crack it. That's the news for the moment. Our next bulletin, 7 o'clock. Now the weather forecast. The cold, unsettled weather will continue with frost overnight on high ground and showers in all areas. Next news and weather is at 10. Thanks. Thanks for the call, Colonel. Chief Constable, it's Inspector Rennie here. I thought you'd like to know, sir, we've got the name. Billy Downs, our doing. Well, I'm going home now, and they'll buzz me as soon as he's netted. Good night, sir. <laughs> 